determine the x and the line intercept, then graph each line, starting with 7. Okay, so we determine the y intercept by plugging 0 in for x. So 5 times 0 minus 4y minus 20 is equal to 0. 5 times 0 is just 0. Then I can add 20 to both sides of the equation. These cancel out. Negative 4y is equal to 0 plus 20, 20. And we can divide both sides by negative 4. So y would be equal to 20 over negative 4, negative 5. And that is the y-intercept. So we start at the origin, go down by 5 units. And that is the y-intercept. y equals negative 5. Excellent. So what about the x-intercept? We just plug in 0 for y instead. So 5x minus 4 times 0 minus 20 equals 0. 4 times 0 is 0. And we can add 20 to both sides of the equation. So 5x will be equal to 0 plus 20, 20. Then I can divide both sides by 5. And x will be 20 over 5, 4. So start at 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, for x. There we go. Okay, now we can just connect the dots, right, and graph the line. There we go. So this is 5x minus 4y minus 20 equals 0. How about question 8? So 3x plus 7y minus 21 equals 0. Now let's determine the y-intercept first. I'll plug in 0 for x. So 3 times 0 plus 7y minus 21 equals 0. 3, zero, three times 0 is 0. And I can add 21 to both sides of the equation. So 7y equals 0 plus 21, 21. Then I can divide both sides by 7. So y is equal to 21 over 7, which is just 3. So that is the y-intercept. Start here at 0, 1, 2, 3. There we go. And what about the x-intercept? Now let's set y to 0. So 3x plus 7 times 0 plus 21 is 0. 7 times 0 is 0. I can, I can subtract 21 from both sides of the equation. 21 minus 21 is just 0. And 3x is equal to 0 minus 21, negative 21. Then we divide both sides by 3. And x will be equal to negative 21 over 3, negative 7. So we start over here. Z sorry, at <laughs> 0, 0. And we go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. That is our x-intercept. Now we can connect the dots. There we go. And of course we go the other way as well. That was a little bit off, so let me try it again. That is better. And of course we go the other way as well. That's it. Okay. And the blue line, of course, represents 3x plus 7y minus 21 equals 0.